Hey everyone, it's me Logistic Bark and as always welcome back to the channel. I'm very excited for today because as pretty much everyone is aware, Cyberpunk is out, it's out there in the world after all these years and delays. I'm so excited and I've got a few things I could do today. Now I've got to look at the launch trailer and I want to see what they're offering in photo mode. But for this video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing. It isn't for the collector's edition, I'm going to be saving the best till last and filming that after this. This video is for a... It's a replica of Johnny Silverhand's arm. I went to my local game shop to pick up the collector's edition and it was just sat there on the back shelf of all the other stuff, like the strategy guides. And I was just like... No. My bank account said no. My heart said yes, and I got it. <laughs> it's not like a life-size replica, because let's face it, that would be ridiculously expensive. But it's a pretty decent size, and it's actually great for me, because I have run out of space. I've got 23 collector's editions, about 40 or 50 figurines, so this being relatively... Re you know, it's, it's... I should be able to fit this in somewhere. <laughs> but without further ado get the sticker off the box and it'll look a bit nicer on the camera. I'm really excited. <sighs> Come on, I don't want to damage this box. <gasps> it's always satisfying when a sticker comes off clean and it hasn't damaged it. But here we go. Nice shiny snazzy box here. As you can see it's a pretty decent size still. But like I said, it's pretty convenient for someone like me who has no space left. Right. Got my trusty crafting knife. Let's go. Careful. Safety first and all that. Okay. Pretty standard like styrofoam type box here. I'm just gonna wrestle this thing out. It's like trying to get into Fort Knox. Hey. Very carefully take this out. The base. Show you guys the base. Has like a little thing here so in it's official what the cyberpunk logo the base is actually quite weighty that's what she said not what i was expecting i thought it would be a bit lighter but this is hefty not as hefty as the fucking collector's edition <laughs> and here's the arm itself the arm is lighter than the base which is a relief because otherwise it would be a monster let's have a quick look myself Dang! Here we go. I will get some photos up so you guys can get a better look at this, but here we are. It's about, this was 60 quid. 60 pounds, in case anyone's not familiar with that, but... The detail on this is really impressive, and unfortunately my webcam does not do it justice. It's beautiful. Let's uh, figure out how this goes on the base. Should be fairly straightforward. Right. She says. I think that's it. I'm just being really careful of it. But here we go, guys. For the price, I think it's definitely worth getting this if you can find it. Base is nice. The arm's got an incredible amount of detail in it. And yeah, for 60 quid, it's a really good find. I am super happy with this. It'll go very nicely with my Johnny Silverhand figurine I picked up a few months ago. But yeah, this will uh, make a fine addition to the collection. <laughs> 